me, you, and my Subaru, doing Reiki sessions in the middle of nowhere. Come along and join me for some Reiki, Nature's Way. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome. My name is Malika. I am a Reiki master at Nature's Way Reiki, and uh, I shoot Reiki videos um, in the middle of nowhere and sometimes in the middle of somewhere. So today I just finished filming in my backyard, and I just wanted to come on and just check in about my surgery and just tell you guys how I'm doing as of today. Um, so far, so good. Um, the healing is going much better than I expected. Uh, last time I had the surgery, I, I was still feeling all kinds of weird things in my chest. Uh, I call it the flip-flops. My heart was flip-flopping all over the place and it was feeling, um, yeah, just it wasn't feeling quite right. But something about this procedure this time around, I feel like they got it. They got the SVT and they got the AFib and something else the doctor told me, but I don't remember what it was called. Um, when I see him in November, I will find out what it was, but I, it's just something I just can't remember. And of course I was under a lot of medication, so I was a little loopy, like really loopy and dopey. <laughs> so, but um, yeah, everything seems to be going well so far. Uh, so, like I said, if I came outside of my house and got dressed, it's because I felt good. I felt good enough that I could shoot a video for today. Um, the only thing that has been bothering me a lot longer than I thought is my neck. They had um, went into my neck. You're not going to be able to see it, but it's like a little bee sting. Like I have a little scar, not a scar, but like a, a scab where they went into my neck to go down into my heart as well as three spots in my groin up to my heart. But this here was, has been so tender and it's been painful um, for a few, for a good while. I mean, I had the surgery on October 3rd and what are we now? It's um, October 17th. So uh, let's see, on the weekend I was sitting outside and I sneezed. Oh my goodness. The sneeze had me, I saw stars and I started to cry because it hurt so bad. So I put my hand on my neck and I went inside and I got some ice and I just put some ice there to help. And then I ended up having to call urgent care on the other day um, because yeah, it was very uncomfortable. So they told me 20 minutes of heat, 20 minutes of ice and since I take blood thinners I cannot have uh, ibuprofen or um, those anti-inflammatory pills uh, drugs because that will cause me to bleed more so I can only do Tylenol and she told me that I could take Benadryl so the Benadryl can help with um, the swelling so I've been doing that and so far so good. Um, it's really helped me, it's made me sleepy. But um, as of today, I don't feel as bad as I did yesterday or the day before. So I'm getting it, I'm knocking this out. I will be 100% before I know it. Still have some energy, you know, um, issues, you know, I can't do too much without having to lie down and take a nap. This, I swear, this, takes you from your fitness level from 100% and then you fall all the way back down to square one. So that's where I'm at. So I keep telling myself I am going to be back to where I used to be in a couple of months and I can do it. And the thing that I am most happy about is I am still here. I I'm here to see another day. I am here to send this energy out to each and every one of you, and I will keep doing it. This is what I am here for, to send this energy out to all of you, and I will keep doing it. I can 
take a deep breath and say, I'm grateful, so grateful to all of you. I am so grateful to my nurses and doctors and everybody who does so much to keep a person alive, you know, and uh, I'm grateful for all of it. Uh, thank you, thank you to all of you new subscribers, all of you who watch the videos. Uh, I am so happy that I'm sending energy out to someone. Um, yeah, so thank you so much, and uh, I will talk to you guys all soon, and love you guys. Until next time, bye for now.